sucks. I'm already like gonna cry just sitting here. Would you take it? Would you do another story? I'm gonna giggle. Because I'm nervous. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm nervous. I'm kind of nervous. <laughs> dear Mia V, Mia V. Haley. Dear Nelly. Dear Sydney. Dear Sophia. Dear Charlie. Dear Sophia. Just writing you this letter to let you know how extremely proud I am of you. As we sit down to write this letter, it's hard to believe that your college soccer journey is coming to a close. We cannot believe that you're now a senior. It seems like yesterday you were off to heading to Huntington. Oh wait, we have to go back and get your wallet. I forgot my wallet and we already got there so my mom drove back to Canada and got it. Um, okay, we are off to West Virginia. But this story started years ago. It feels like yesterday you first laced up your football boots and now here you are, ready for your senior game. Time does go by fast. It is hard to believe that you are already a senior in college playing the last few games of your final competitive season. During these next few weeks, your mother and I would like to encourage you to really treasure this time for yourself and with your teammates as it will go too quickly. Six years of, of sweat, determination, and countless memories have brought you to this moment, and we couldn't be prouder of everything you've accomplished, both on and off the field. <laughs> I can't go to <laughs> Ever since you were a little girl, you had such a passion. I <laughs> academic sports, but particularly soccer. That was senior day, and we would love to have you have to be with, there with you. And you know that, unfortunately, we couldn't. We parents understood early on that you were interested in soccer. Your older brother was, and still is, good at soccer and become a role model for you. Uh, you also have many friends who wanted to play soccer, and so we could see the talent starting to form in the back. Backyard. The moment you were born, letting me know that you were one of a kind, you knocked me out. You've been knocking me out ever since with your outstanding athleticism, your incredible intelligence, and your awesome beauty. We have watched you learn so many lessons about life on the soccer field, more than many will learn in a lifetime. Through the years, you have mastered leadership, teamwork, sportsmanship, humbleness, humility, and grace and defeat. These skills will carry you further than any soccer career ever could. Your, <laughs> your grand pronouncement? that you began, you sc would score six goals on your sixth birthday, which we thought may be ambitious, before scoring five in the second half to back up <laughs> your, your goals. Just look, you look just like your dad, ha ha. It's been a pleasure being your dad since the day you were born. I can't do this so <laughs> fast. Hey, look at this. Look at that. Now look at us. We're so old. with your hard work, determination, and passion for the sport. Through all the wins and losses, you have always shown incredible strength and never give up attitude. Your commitment and drive have not only made you a fantastic football player, but also a wonderful person. We also want you to reflect on your journey to this point. We have watched and supported you from the first days as a marshmallow and want you to know that we absolutely that we will absolutely be there watching you with that final whistle blows as a Spartan. Um, when you then started playing in a team, you and your friend showed early on that you were talented and pushed each other to develop. Both in, both in training and in matches uh, against other teams, you showed good communication, commitment and motivation right from the start. We still remember the way you laced up your cleats as a little girl, filled with excitement to just run, play, and kick the ball. All the memories and moments, the best and worst times, all happened with a soccer ball at your feet. Recall the bonds you made, friendships that were created. Remember us in the stands at all your games and practices. 14 plus years of soccer is an experience that is a part of our lives as much as it is a part of yours. While your competitive soccer playing is coming to an end, don't be sad as you have your whole life in front of you and we cannot wait to see what you do next. Selfishly, I know that I would like you to keep the beautiful game of soccer in your life in some way as maybe a recreational player, a fan, a coach, or even as a soccer mom. I can only hope as that would make me a soccer granddad. You also had a lot of fun. 
that was the basis for you as a team becoming so strong so early on. As your father, but also your coach during your early youth years, it was fantastic to be able to follow you and your team's development. It's been a pleasure being your dad since the day you were born. Also, great, great pleasure for me being your coach. You've always killed it, and I mean killed it. You've, been, you've also been my favorite opponent for ping pong. You've been dominating me, but I'll sneak out a game from you every once in a while. Oh, and by the way, I have the belt this time. My, my back is bothering me wearing this belt, haha, ha, so we have to play again soon. Who could have known back then that those first touches would lead to a six-year NCAA career? And now here we are celebrating you as a graduate student athlete. We couldn't be more proud. There is no way we can put into words how proud we are of the person you have become and all your accomplishments both on and off the soccer field. Similarly, there are no way to quantify how much joy you have brought us watching you grow from a little girl to the beautiful young woman that you are today. The last time we watch you walk off that field this season will be just as bittersweet for us as it is for you. But it's not the end, just to come on your life, a preview for the next chapter as we continue to watch you. This is the end of an end, but the beginning of a new. You always had a goal to, and a plan to get there. Climbing the ladder from Bell River to Tecumseh, onto LaSalle and Eastside Kickers, each a stepping stone before your desire to play in Michigan and ultimately challenge yourself against the best. <laughs> I know you're just starting out and you're gonna blow this world away. I can't wait to continue following your journey or following you on this awesome journey. I love you very much. From the days of the snowplow field, you've shown what it means to truly be committed to something you love. Whether you're just leading your team to victory or pushing through injuries and setbacks, you've always handled yourself with grace and strength. In the process, you've inspired all of us. You inspire everyone around you with your energy and leadership. It's a privilege to be a part of your journey and to see you grow and develop both on and off the field. One thing that stands out is your unwavering commitment to justice and standing up for what you believe in. It takes immense courage to remain true to your values and you do so with grace and conviction. Congratulations, Lily. We're so happy for you. You've been such a great inspiration to us and to all of your teammates and we're just so proud of you. And we know it's on a journey that has to always been easy, but we can't tell you just how proud we are again you and your accomplishments. So. You will think of past seasons, years that seemed so long ago, you will remember the time when soccer was your life and you loved every moment of it. You will remember the feeling you had before every game. That is what you take with you. Continue to love the sport and the lessons and the relationships. Continue to be better than you were the day before, whether it's your first touch or the person you aspire to be and the life you want to live. You made so many sacrifices along the way. Whether spending hours driving to practice, studying in odd locations, and missing family events with friends and family, you were determined to get to the next level and play college soccer. You made the decision to move to Michigan and build it while all of Canada was on lockdown. But that singular focus paid off when you received an offer to play at Marshall. You used that opportunity to excel academically while suffering an injury setback. I am so happy we are all here to celebrate your special day. You should be so proud of all the accomplishments you've made so far and excited for what's next to come. I can't explain what a blessing you are to our family and you are loved so much. You've had to make some difficult decisions over the past four years, and you've come out shining. Watching you play soccer has been one of my, one of my favorite memories. Together with your friends, you grew not only as a soccer player, but also as a person. When you get a little older, we continue to follow your development from the stands. Your soccer skills earned you a place in the regional team for three years. On a few occasions, you were also selected for a camp in the Swedish national team's second team in your age group. For three years, you had a permanent standing place in the girls' team, 7 to 19 years, um, for the elite club in Uppsala in the second division in Sweden. You were also often an obvious choice for team captaining these teams. Take away from this letter and this season that we are so proud of you. We are proud of the person you are. We say it all the time, but it's something we need you to always remember. Soccer is a part of you, but it's not who you are. Soccer is both the character you are, but it's not your definition. Take pride in the athlete you are, the memories you have, and be proud of the years and hard work you put in. 
best of luck on uh, your senior night. We love you very much. We love you. I used to yell this at me because she was never in the Your former coaches once said, Nelly is a player who cannot be stopped, she just keeps going. This perfectly sums up the relent relentless spirit and dedication you bring to the game. Watching you this season, we can remember all the games and tournaments, practices, technical sessions, and speed agility trainings. With these memories, we also remember your high points and the low points of your career. We watched you work so hard and push through so many challenges to become the player and the person you are today. You have learned so many qualities from the game of soccer, including leadership, accountability, teamwork, sportsmanship, still thinking about this one though, as we know that you really hate losing, and humility. I have no doubt that the same passion and dedication you put into soccer will lead you to incredible things. We've checked for you in every game, but we've all, oh no, we've cheered for you in every game, we've also cheered for you in life, watching you grow into the strong, independent, and charismatic person you are today. We can't wait to see where life takes you next. Ultimately, you made the decision to transfer, a decision solely made by you, and it has paid off hugely. Sure, there was another injury. At this point, it would be appropriate to acknowledge the efforts of your personal orthopedic surgeon, <laughs> Dr. Greg JC. <laughs> you still, or you also have learned that through hard work and determination will lead to results. These traits, were ser these, these traits will serve you well. Again, there is no way we can possibly express our pride in what you have accomplished and the person you have become. Every soccer player has a unique essence about them that makes them individuals. For us, you have always brought us so much joy to the game and I will never stop telling you that no one player moves the way you do with the ball at your feet. We're so incredibly proud of everything you have achieved so far and we're excited to see what the future holds for you. Regardless of today's match result, know that you have already won in our eyes for the person you have become and the effort you've put in. Keep fighting, our dear Nelly. You have all our love and support today and always. But you were never allowed injuries to define your soccer career or limit your contributions to the team, as you always had a plan to encourage, assist, and lead. You doubled down on your academics and will graduate from such an esteemed university in the spring of 2025. Your playing career may be over, but we... Wouldn't be surprised if you continue to be involved in soccer in some way. The plan is probably already <laughs> percolating in your mind. We hope when you enjoy, when you look back on your youth, that you enjoy the experiences as much as we enjoy sharing them with you. To forgetting your wallet twice, <laughs> to hitting a deer, to losing power steering, to being a walk-on with the Jags, and to many, many border crossings, to Panera Bread and Jimmy John's. <laughs> to lifelong friendships, to landing in Tampa, and having the time of your life. Watching you play has always been my favorite thing to do. All the travel across Florida and other places, sometimes across the country with your mother, will soon be the memories in our minds, ones that will last us a lifetime and will forever be ingrained. Even though our days as soccer parents are coming to an end, we will never lose the memories we have of watching you play. These will always bring us joy. Always remember that no matter where you go, you always have the biggest fans right here. Remember? <laughs> Experiences have shaped you into the wonderful, mature, intelligent, and thoughtful woman you have become. Thank you for allowing us to enjoy this journey together. We are so excited for you as you move forward in the next chapter of your life. I loved all of our tournament trips and will traverse those memories we were able to spend together. Your future holds so many more memories, and I know you'll be amazing. As you put your uniform and stinky shin guards on, oh yes, they're absolutely disgusting, and I will not really miss that foul odor that seems to linger in cars. And lace up your cleats for the last time. You need to play those last 90 minutes playing harder than you ever have, leaving it all on the field. No regrets, no thinking, just playing. No holding back and finishing strong. Be thankful for all the friendships you have made, as some of these will last a lifetime. While the game of soccer has been a big part of your life, it does not define you or what you will do going forward. We wouldn't change a thing and we couldn't be prouder of you. We will always wear our soccer mom and soccer dad identification proudly and remember the years we had together at a sport our child was amazing at playing. So until the next letter during this lifetime, we're so very proud of you and will always be your biggest fans. We now see a young woman who has become wise and independent 
Uh, you're also confident in yourself and strong, both physically and mentally. Uh, we're so happy and proud uh, that you're our daughter. We really look forward to following your next phase in life. Just remember, we will always support you and continue to be your biggest fans. Love your mom and dad. Oh my god. <laughs> love you more than anything. We all love you. <laughs> Annika, Henrik, and Oliver. With so much love, mom and dad. <laughs> love, mom and dad. <laughs> love you, mom and dad. Remember, receiver, your chapel talk. The rest is still red. Oh. Love mom, dad. <laughs>